everyone welcome back to my youtube channel i'm soraya and i make youtube videos when i can on mondays and fridays is my usual upload days and if you are new around here and you enjoy some of my videos then please don't forget to subscribe and if you enjoyed this video then give it a like and check out some of my other ones this is going to be my march and my april favorites there's not many things that i'm going to be going through but the majority of them seem to be clothing for some reason and yeah i will have everything linked down below if i can that i mention in this video please let me know what your favorite things have been in these last two months and let's get cracking my first favorite is these trainers these trainers i was given i want to say at christmas from my sister and my parents and i have honestly been enjoying wearing them to the gym so much they're just so comfortable to work out in whether it's leg day or not leg day they're just such nice trainers and i feel like white trainers with any sort of gym wear just looks the part and these i believe are the adidas l no i knew i was gonna get it wrong adidas xlpr juniors I don't actually know if I'm saying that right, but like I said, I will have them linked down below. But I absolutely love them. They're so easy to get on and off as well. You know, with some trainers, they're just a nightmare to sort of slip on and off. These are not. Absolutely loved wearing these in the last couple of months. And I know that I will continue wearing them in months to come. The next thing, I only have the bottoms to show you because the top half is in the wash in both the colours that I bought. But I did mention this item in my misguided slash sheen haul so if you uh watch that then you'll know what this item looks like i've really been loving the jogger set that i bought from misguided and this is one of the colors that i purchased i purchased two colors i got this one here um which is like a oatmeal sort of color and i also well it's like a light beige and i also bought like a mocha brown color as well and i've honestly just loved lounging around in these but also going outside in these because that is the beauty of this jogger set is that you can just chill at home in it but if you want to throw it on to quickly nip to the su supermarket with a coat over the top then you'll be good to go as well and they're just so comfortable these have already had um a wash yes they've only had a wash once but they've still come out as soft as when i bought them so we'll see if that's still the same case after a few more washes but yeah they have got an elasticated ankle they are full length trousers with pockets may i add no zips on the pocket but they do have pockets and then they've got an elasticated waist as well and as i mentioned in the misguided haul i sized down in these so i'm usually a uk size six and these are a no i'm usually a uk size eight and these are a size six and they fit me absolutely March I did a huge sort of my protein haul I actually get 50% off NHS discount with my protein which I think is absolutely incredible so I bought myself a few, a few things and I also bought my boyfriend a few things and then we also got like some protein powders as well and I had been needing and wanting mostly needing to be honest some new hoodies um to go to the gym uh with and i'd looked at loads of places and the problem i was having was i couldn't find hoodies that were not cropped so i didn't want a cropped hoodie i wanted a full length hoodie um that had pockets with zips 
Now, I got the full length with my protein, but I didn't get the zipped pockets. However, the pockets are quite big. I bought two colors. The black one is in the washing machine at the moment, so I can't show you that. But this is the gray one that I bought. And as you can see, it's got a nice big hood, which I like because especially in the winter when you are walking to the gym and it's quite cold outside it's nice to have a nice big hood um it's got the straps for the hood as well it's got a lovely big zip and then it's got the pockets now with this gray hoodie um some of the stitching has actually come off so i don't know if it was already like that when i bought it i can't remember it being like that but it just yeah i think it's faulty so it needs um stitching back up again but as you can see the pockets are really nice and big and then it's got the mp for my protein logo on the back and it's just really plain and simple like there's no sort of logos on the back as well and that is exactly this is like exactly the sort of hoodie that i was looking for and i've really been enjoying wearing them to the gym taking it off once i've warmed up popping it back on once I'm finished my workout and obviously you don't just have to wear them to the gym you can wear them as casual hoodies as well but if you are looking for a really simple but comfortable full length hoodie for the gym or just for casual wear then definitely go on the my protein website and have a look and see what they've got I think there was three different colors um, I just got the grey and the black and they're really affordable hoodies as well. Moving on to a book that I really enjoyed reading in March. I feel like pretty much all of my favourite videos have to feature a book because I'm just such a bookworm. I love reading. I wish I had more time to read but yeah in March the book that I really enjoyed reading was this one here. This book is by Zoe Sugg who is like a really famous youtuber who i've been watching for years and years now and an author called amy mcculloch and this is their collaboration book magpie society this is the first book there is another one that's currently being written by them and potentially it will be a trilogy i'm not sure um i got myself the signed copy basically i got given a waterstones um gift card when i left my old nursing job and i decided to get myself the signed version because it was exactly the same price as the normal version so why not um but yes this is a uh, one for sorrow it's basically like a, like a young adult um crime investigation so a girl appears um dead on you know in the sea she's got this magpie tattoo on her back and everyone is sort of freaking out and it's just um going through trying to find out who did it and honestly i just absolutely loved it it did end obviously on a bit of a cliffhanger um which is in preparation for the second book which is um two for joy um obviously one for sorrow two for joy um but honestly i absolutely loved reading this book i think i read it in two or three sittings and the font as well which makes all of the difference it's just a joy to read through honestly like it was really really well written i'd never read anything by zoe sugg but i have read some books written by amy and they are just both amazing authors and i would definitely recommend this book to anybody as well if you're into young adult and sort of crime scene investigations next two things i'm going to show you are two pairs of pajamas so obviously recently things started opening up again and i went to westfield shopping center in london and i bought myself a few things from boo avenue which included two well actually i bought three pairs of pajamas just because i needed most of my pajamas replacing so 
Boo Avenue had an amazing sale on so I thought why not and the first pair which I bought myself is this lovely pair here so it's just some long trousers with these lovely little love hearts on and then the band is like nice and cinched in and these actually sit like high-waisted on me I think they are meant to be high-waisted trousers and then the top is so so cute as well um it's a long sleeve top but it's cropped and it has this little tie uh at the front and honestly i just feel like so pretty and ready for my beauty sleep when i have this on um <laughs> which sounds ridiculous but it's nice to feel nice in pajamas you know and honestly they are so soft and I just think I'm gonna get so much use out of these because I've had a pair of Boo Avenue pajamas before which my boyfriend bought for me but like when we first got together and they lasted for so long because the material is so good they had plenty of washes and they still came out as new and the second pair which I have been loving is some little shorts in this absolutely gorgeous uh, dusky pink colour. Guys, I wish you could feel how soft these are. It's absolutely luxurious. So yeah, they've got um, this drawstring on the waist and then oh, the top is just adorable as well. So this is the top, long sleeved again super super soft and i just absolutely love this color and you couldn't ask for a more luxurious pair of pajamas i just absolutely love them next one is going to be a lip balm now this actually was bought so my boyfriend actually bought this lip balm because he had been getting really really sore lips just all of a sudden he had really sore red lips they were dry they were hurting him um he don't know he doesn't really know what caused it but he went to well we went to sainsbury's together and he found this lip product and he used it on his lips and it made Made such a difference for him and then strangely enough the same thing happened to me about a week ago um, I started getting really dry sore lips again really red um, and I'm someone who uses quite a lot of lip balm anyway I normally use Vaseline he told me to give this product a go because it worked for him so maybe it would work for me and oh my goodness it definitely did and this is the lip balm that I'm talking about I believe this was about three pounds from Sainsbury's um, and it is the O'Keefe's lip repair unscented lip balm guaranteed relief for extremely dry cracked lips and honestly it absolutely works it says it does what it says on the packaging it literally relieved my lips instantly and within two three days i would say they were completely back to normal this product is honestly incredible and if you are suffering from like really sore cracked dry red lips for whatever reason honestly get yourself this tiny little orange thing because it was incredible how fast it it worked <laughs> i just couldn't believe it um and yeah this is definitely something that i would recommend to anyone if you are suffering okay the last two things i'm going to talk about are two netflix series which i watched during march slash april and i am obsessed guys obsessed like i literally pretty much binge watch both of them one i watched with alan my boyfriend and then the other one i watched on my own although he is currently watching it now they're both um one season out at the moment but i believe there's a second season coming out for both of these series so the first one that i want to talk about is the irregulars so this one is 
A crew of misfits investigates a series of supernatural crimes in Victorian London for Dr. Watson and his shadowy associate Sherlock Holmes. So this one is all about um, this group of four kids or four friends who are living in London. Uh, no, it's actually, yeah, so four friends living in like the streets of London and then they meet a prince. Um, who also then joins in the investigations and there's loads of crime scenes going on around the area weird crime scenes um, and they're just trying to solve why they're happening who's doing them etc um, I'm not going to give too much away obviously but honestly it is so so good it's one of those where you kind of watch the first episode and you feel like you're not really into it but then as you carry on you are just hooked so i will link the trailer down below for you and if you feel like it's a bit of you then definitely go and check it out it's only eight episodes long so it's a really short and quick one easy watch and the second one is lock and key so this one basically is about a family uh their surname is Locke and they move into this key house which has been uh, in the family for a number of years and Bodhi who is the youngest of the three children um, he starts hearing these whispers and he starts finding all these keys around the house and these keys do different magical things and honestly guys i'm so excited for season two it's so amazing to see and discover what all the different keys do um there's a really good twist at the end as well so i love a series that has like an unexpected twist at the end um and yeah like i said there's only one season out at the moment and this um series has got 10 episodes so again a nice quick and easy watch and again i'll link it down below for you so you can watch the trailer that is it for today's video i really hope that you guys enjoyed it and i will see you very very soon with another video bye